Right, that was very scary. The batteries got disconnected and it went up to 85 volts. So I waited till it went down and then put the brake on, as you see now. Uh, still trying to go round. I have decided for another experiment, which we're going to do now. Right. I've got to take the brake off and then I've got to run inside because the turbine is going to start motoring. Rectifier, meter, speed controller, dump load. Keep an eye on that, there should be some activity there. Let's keep going for the show. Oh, straight to the top loading, beauty! This thing is working on a tree. What will be interesting to see is if it drops out and stops making power, or if those big blades carry on. If it stays at around 100 watts, I'll turn the dump load down a bit. So I can turn the dump load down, off for a minute, watch the voltage increase. This turbine starts going faster and faster. We'll let it get above 30 and I'll put the dump load on. Oh, I see it can't fire. It needs a lot, a lot of wind. If I turn it to maximum, then the turbine will pretty much stop. So I know that was only a short experiment. But I was quite impressed with the way that performed there. So yeah, that's, that was an experiment connecting a wind turbine directly to a dump load. So if there's enough wind, and next time there's a lot of wind, we'll try that. Sweet.